Did you know you have access to the fastest internet in Washington State? Switch to iFiber Communications right now and take advantage of our amazing special offers. Pay only $29.95 per month for 100 meg high-speed internet or get three months of internet absolutely free. You heard that right. Internet for only $29.95 per month or three months of internet free. Shop, stream, and game like never before with iFiber Communications high-speed internet. Call 509-754-2600 or check out iFiber.tv. History was made on Wednesday night at the Grand County International Airport when Japan's first new commercial aircraft in decades finally touched down on American soil. The Mitsubishi Regional Jet Prototype arrived in Moses Lake after delays pushed back its arrival in the United States to begin flight certification with the Federal Aviation Administration. The Port of Moses Lake rolled out the red carpet, providing a water cannon rainbow as the jet pulled up to the 65,000 square foot hangar that will house it and three other planes for the next four years. Mitsubishi officials said the planes have to undergo about 2,500 hours of testing to gain FAA certification. Port of Moses Lake Commission President David Ken Jones was among those pleased to see the plane at the Grand County International Airport. As you're aware, Japan Airlines left here and the last time I saw a plane go under the water that the fire trucks were putting out was a very sad day because that was the, uh, the departure of the last JAL plane. And I can tell you, it's a great feeling today to watch the MRJ come through there and uh, the, the work that Aerotech and Mitsubishi, and every, I guess it's time for everybody to go to work for real now. We've just been practicing to this point. In Moses Lake, Devin Higgins for iFiber One News. Oh, <laughs>